Hey everybody, how's it going? Thank you so much for tuning in, and for those of you who haven't visited the channel, welcome to x Rides Cars. Today, let's go ahead and take a look at this 2017 Hyundai Sonata. So this will be a full take of the Sonata Sport. We'll start it up, show the engine, get an exhaust clip, and go over the performance data, as well as show you a bunch of the unique aspects in both the interior as well as exterior. And so, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. The exterior color is known as Lakeside Blue, featuring a full light gray cloth interior with black accents. The Sonata comes standard with speed proportional, electric assist, rack and pinion power steering on a four spoke leather wrapped steering wheel with multifunction controls on the top two spokes. The Sonata comes standard with a six speed automatic transmission, but you can also have manual shifting on the column. And so we'll go ahead and flip on the automatic headlights, as well as the hazards. Driver's side window is fully automatic. So let's go ahead and check out the exterior, shall we? The first Sonata was introduced to compete with the Daewoo Royale series and was built using the main components from the Stellar. It included cruise control, power seats, headlamp washers, power brakes, electric operated adjustable side mirrors, and chrome bumper trims. The Hyundai Sonata was available with two trim options in Korea, Luxury and Super. Engine choices included a 1.6 liter Mitsubishi Saturn and a 1.8 or 2 liter Mitsubishi Sirius inline 4 cylinder. It was sold in New Zealand in right hand drive with the 1.6 liter Mitsubishi engine with a 5 speed manual transmission or an automatic transmission which was an optional extra. There was a version of the Stellar known as the Stellar 88 launched to celebrate the 1988 Summer Olympics in Seoul. After Stellar 88, Hyundai discontinued the Stellar series and changed it to the Sonata series. The Y2 Sonata was part of Hyundai's expansion in North America after the success of the XL. It was introduced in South Korea on June 1, 1988. It was then introduced in Canada in September 1988 as a 1989 model, and on 14th of November 1988 in the United States as the 1989 model, and in March 1989 in Australia. It replaced the Stellar as Hyundai's large family car. Sonatas were built in Ulsan, Korea, and in Bromont, Quebec. The Sonata was designed by Hyundai and featured Mitsubishi's engineering, including the platform from the Galant and its 2.4-liter Sirius inline four-cylinder engine used in American market models. A 3-liter V6 engine based on Mitsubishi 6G72 arrived in 1990. Other markets received a 1.8 or 2-liter engine carried over from the first generation, but equipped with MPI replacing their carb carbureted com counterparts used in the Y1. 
The US model received the 2 liter engine for 92, replacing the original 2.4 liter engine. The Y3 debuted in 1993. The base engine in most markets was the 2 liter Sirius, but there was also a 3 liter meat species V6 option in some markets. The Y3 was also produced as the Hyundai Marcia between 1995 and 1998, selling alongside the Sonata in South Korea only. The Marcia differed from the Sonata with its restyled front and rear fascias. The Kia Optima, called the Magentus outside of the US, was based on the same automobile platform of this generation of Sonata and shared the same doors and some other panels. The Sonata also shared a platform with the first generation Hyundai Santa Fe, the compact crossover SUV. Hyundai issued a facelift for the EF in 2001 for 2002 model year. New front and rear styling featured and the original EF rear vehicle registration plate alcove repositioned from the bottom bumper to the trunk lid. Hyundai commenced development of the YF Sonata in 2005 with a development cost of 450 billion South Korean won, translating to 372 US dollars. In the Australian, New Zealand, Singaporean, and Colombian markets, the YF was retailed under the name under the name Hyundai i45. Following the alphanumeric i series nomenclature established by Hyundai in these markets, the vehicle was badged as Sonata in Eastern Europe, just as in North America and South Korea. Sales of the YF Sonata in South Korea began on September 2009, before the production vehicle's South Korean launch. The U.S. version of the 6th generation Sonata was unveiled at the 2009 Los Angeles Auto Show, with sales beginning in 2010 for the 2011 model year. The Sonata was the second vehicle to carry Hyundai's then-radical, fluidic sculpture design language. Originally internally coded as the LFA, the 2015 Sonata was unveiled in Seoul, South Korea in late March 2014, and it was unveiled in America at the 2014 New York International Auto Show. While the previous model incorporated significant aesthetic changes and sold successfully within the U.S. sales, in Korea failed to meet expectations. A more conservative approach was thus taken to appease the Korean market, resulting in Fluidic Sculpture 2.0. In Australia and New Zealand, Hyundai have reverted to use the Sonata badge, replacing the i45 badge that was used only in the 6th generation in the market. The facelifted 7th generation Sonata was unveiled in April 2017. The exterior received a radical design more in line with the 6th generation, including new taillights, cascading grille, and an optional vertical LED lighted. The dashboard was also reshaped with new air vents on the driver's side and a larger touchscreen that is compatible with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. The interior also received the new steering wheel, gear shift, and instrument cluster. Other standard features added in this refresh include standard wireless phone charger and a USB port for rear passengers. The Hyundai Blue Link telematic system was also upgraded to be compatible with Amazon Echo and Google Home devices. While this is a preface of vehicle, this particular car does not receive all those added extras. Projector headlights, LED daytime running lights, fog lights, chrome trim across the sides, large exhaust tips. This Sonata comes standard with the 17-inch 10-spoke alloy wheels and two 1555 tires with front ventilated disc brakes with standard rear disc brakes with anti-locking, electronic brake distribution, and brake assist. The Sonata comes with a McPherson strut front suspension and a multi-link rear suspension with front rear stabilizer bars, coil springs, and gas pressurized shock absorbers. The vehicle has a length of 191.1 inches with a width of 73.4 inches and a height of 58.1 inches running on a 110.4 inch wheelbase. Turbo curb weight can be about 3311 pounds. Well, let's go ahead and pop the hood. The Sonata comes standard with a 2.4 liter 16 valve double overhead cam inline 4 cylinder engine. It produces 185 horsepower at 6000 RPM 
and 178 pound-feet of torque at 4,000 RPM. 0 to 100 kilometers an hour or 0 to 62 miles an hour are rated at 7.9 seconds with an electronically limited top speed of 132 miles an hour. This car is front-wheel drive and has an 18 and a half gallon tank requiring 87 octane petrol fuel. EPA estimated miles per gallon ratings for 25 city and 35 highway. Open up the Sonata and you get a really nice place to sit. Power windows, locks and mirrors, power driver seat. So we'll go ahead and shut her up. Nice solid panels. This Sonata does come standard with the standard audio system, but it sounds incredible. Got your vanity mirrors, which are illuminated. And you have a credit card holder. Reading lights, door lights, sunglass compartment. Coming down here, you have your entertainment system, which includes radio, media, and Bluetooth, and a CD player, which is really unique. And it also includes radio. You have your dual zone climate control, which, no, it's single zone, sorry, I forgot that one. So, fan, of course, controls, of course, where you want it, and front defrost, rear defrost, recycling, and air conditioning. Coming down here, you have two 12 volt power outlets and a USB and auxiliary port. Transmission shifter, two cup holders, driver modes, so you have Eco, Sport, center console, and as far as steering wheel, you have other volume controls and, of course, your voice command. Please say a command. Help. Here are some available commands. Please say goodbye. Here are some phone commands. Please. And you also have your cruise control settings. Down here you have your indicators. Which also, if you pull slightly down, indicator will go three times. Just so, in case you're changing lanes in a highway, it's much easier to control than rather ha than having to, like, control yourself. And on your right side, you have your wiper control. And of course, you have pulse, and you have mist. And you, of course, have your other controls, fuel thing, um, fuel filler, trunk, and traction control. And you have your OBD, fuse access right here as well. Alrighty. We'll go ahead and shut her down. So we'll go ahead and check out the rest of the vehicle, shall we? Open up the back seat. Got a good amount of space. 12 volt power outlet. And two cup holders. The Sonata does have an incredible amount of cargo space for its class. You get about 16.3 cubic feet which is surprisingly more than a Toyota Camry. Translating to metrics, it is 462 liters. 
but of course if you fold the rear seats you can expand the storage and you have other things as long as your jack storage and your spare tire you of course do have your battery compartment to the side and to the right hand side there is an included first aid kit as well Passenger seat features manual adjustments. <laughs> Full glove box. The Sonata is a very unique vehicle, even though it's just basic like a Camry, but it's mid-size and it gives you all the features a family sedan will need. Perfect for families of four or five. Well everyone, I hope you enjoyed the video of this 2017 Hyundai Sonata Sport. Be sure to stay tuned next time, there's a lot more where all this came from, and be sure to subscribe today and check out all the future content coming to X-Rides Cars. Take care everybody.